Alright guys, I'm here with another video, you know how it is, um, let me see that. So, I have a Quest 2, so I went and bought this attachment thing for it. Not attachment, it's called the Effortless Charging and Endless Adventure. I got mine in Best Buy. Um... I got mine at Best Buy. It's called the Charging Dock for VR Headset. So, I've been looking at this because I was like, man, if I get a Charging Dock and get the wireless chargers for the, you know what I'm saying, for the headset and stuff, like, I might as well, you know what I mean? So, let's get into it. So, it says, on the box, it says, covers, uh, converts charging controllers, charge without removing the batteries. I just fucking stabbed myself. It says reduces downtime between sessions. Fully charges request to headset and controllers in just two hours. I guess, yeah, almost three. An hour and 50 minutes. Or an hour and two hours and a half. So, like, it's almost three. It says. Damn, I really fucking stabbed myself. It says. Oculus Ready Certified Charging Station says charge both your Quest 2 headset and controllers. It says requires rechargeable A batteries included in the box. Charge time may vary. It says come protection over charge protection over load protection and more works together to pro protect both you and your device. Alright. Let's get into it. The input output, so you have the charging dock by A N K E R says input USB C input five point five volts slash nine point zero V D C magnetic USB C output right and left is one point five input uh, right controller same. Size of it is 14.96 inches and 3.35 inches by 3.35 inches. It says cable length. USB-C to USB-C to C, 4 feet. So you get a 4 foot cable. It's pretty long to be honest. The chat link cable, I didn't do a review on it. It's a 14 foot cable. So, it's open now. Alright. Let's see if I get this open. Oh shit, that's nice. The box is like an apple box. It's like an apple. Alright, so. Here's the charging stand. Oh, that's neat. So I guess you just push that over and it locks in. The controllers go here, right controller, left controller. It's not that big, it's probably as big as my forearm. So that's neat. And it says lift. Comes with a little pull tab like Apple. So you get the chargeable batteries, the USB C port, and I guess that's magnetic. That's hard. So I guess you just keep it in your headset and you just sit it and it magnetics it. It's pretty cool. Unless some Apple would give you. USB-C cable, the power brick, another thing that looks like Apple, I think I have one, no I don't have it anymore, I guess because it didn't work.
That's neat. I like the light gray. I'm not gonna lie. I forget these things are like impossible to get off. I don't even know where fuck these batteries, these batteries came with when I bought it. These batteries gonna be like that. This to get out. Yeah. Alright, so. So these are the batteries. So I guess you just, oh, they're spring loaded. That's why, all right, so you just, Ooh. So I guess you turn it like this. I guess it goes in like that. And you just, I'll show you when it's all done. Mm. Uh, controller. So, keep these. Uh, you don't need batteries, you know what I mean? So, yeah, that's the same way. Positive. This is way bigger than the Quest uh, Quest One controller. I'm putting my hands, but say how much bigger they are. I don't have a Quest, but I gave my sister my Quest. It's no use to me. So, um, let's put this up. Where I should put it? Just run it and set it on the desk. On top of my speaker. Probably isn't a bad idea to just take this, unplug this.
take this. There's also papers under there. Some dumb shit. Oh, here it is. It's like that. Then you got. You just set the controllers, I think, like this. Yep, just like that, and that's how it works.